Here we have the liver, the largest visceral organ. And this is the right lobe of the liver, and this is the left lobe of the liver. And what separates them is this ligament named the falciform ligament. And the falciform ligament ends in the round ligament that we see right here. If we follow the falciform ligament up, we can see here the coronary ligament. Now look at this. This is the right liver lobe and the left liver lobe. If we look at the liver inferiorly, can you notice that this lobe was posterior? So if you're looking at it inferiorly, this was in the back. In another way, we can say the posterior region is caudal. So this is the lobe of the liver that was in the caudal aspect. And that's why this is named caudate lobe. And this one right here that looks like a little square is named quadrate lobe. So caudate lobe and quadrate lobe. Now, another structure we can see in the inferior portion of the liver is the gallbladder. And leaving the gallbladder, we have the cystic duct. Then here, we have another duct, this one. And this duct is leaving the liver lobes. And this duct is named common hepatic duct. When the common hepatic duct gets together with the cystic duct, they form the common bile duct, which is the duct that takes bile towards the duodenum.